Hey guys, just making sure everything's working on my computer. I'm sure it is. I hope it is. It would seem so. Well, I'm here to show you guys, some nice, as you can see by the title, how to get a girlfriend. Okay, ready to find out? Okay, you see a cute girl sitting alone in the bar, texting on her. Excuse me. You don't need music. Um. Uh, uh, where was I? Texting on her phone, looking pretty poor. You want to strike up a conversation with her, what do you do? Just give up and get drunk? You're already at a bar? I would normally do that. Buy her a drink? That's really thirsty, so she'll buy a drink. Um, this one's quite simple, but you don't want to seem like a stalker. I'm going to go with B. Because, you know, that's how the players roll. Co correct. Buy a girl drink is the most basic way of breaking the ice. Girls love to drink drinks. Of course they do. They fucking pop. I mean, what? Uh, and the fact that you bought one for her shows your interest in without being too forward at the same time. Tss. Put your arm around on me. Make a bank for it. I mean, um, yes. You got it so far. Okay. You see a hot girl dancing and you want to win her over. But you're not very good dancer. What do you do? I'm gonna lose this one because I'm not a very good dancer. Uh, okay, teach her how to... <laughs> no. Um, tell her the dancer's name. And for losers, uh, just be act. Just be act. Just act confident. This guy can't look right. And do your best with the moves you have. Learn how to dance. I'm gonna go with act confident because girls love that. Incorrect. Learning how to dance is vital. Girls love you. Of guys who have smooth moves on the dance floor. She's a gimmick. Don't to help you much here if you don't know what to do with a girl in your arms. I know how to do that. That's slow dancing. That's piss easy, mate. Sorry, I thought it meant actual. Doesn't mean. Um, you have a crush on a girl, but she's. Just thinking of you as a good friend. What do you do? Uh, okay. Uh, a. Stop acting distance towards her. No. B. Hang out with her more. Uh, not going to change much. Hit on her best friend to make her jealous. That's sly. Keep acting the same and hope that she'll come around. Okay, this one I should tell you what to do, but I would always go for the number four. Keep acting the same and hope she'll come around. I know it's not correct, but that's the way I'm doing it, so I'm keeping it as that. Incorrect. Start acting distance towards it and make you seem mysterious and therefore desirable. What? Are you smoking, mate? Are you, are you actually serious? When a girl sees you as a friend, it's hard to get her to see you as a possible love interest. Create distance, eliminate the friend zone, and plan your next move from there. And then become a complete stranger, and she don't even care about you because you're a cock. Good idea, mate. So far, so bad. Um, you've been talking to a girl for a while, and it's been going pretty well. She's laughing at your jokes and acting friendly. Well, she. Uh, you want to ask her out, but you're not sure what you would do for your first date. Which should you do? Go to a movie? No, no. You you want to talk to people. You want to like. You can't go to the movie, I know that. Go ice skating. I can't ice skate, so I'm keep, keeping that one away. Uh, go out for coffee or go to a carnival. Coffee seems alright. Carnival, uh, I'm going to go for coffee. Coffee is my thing. Correct. An activity like going to the carnival or going ice skating will be a better idea for a second or third date. Booyah! But something simple like going out for coffee is a good way to get to know each other and develop your relationship on a first date. Uh, maybe it's a bad choice uh, for other days because you want to get to know each other and maybe if it is, is an ideal place to have a conversation. Well, that's your opinion. Uh, a girl you like tells you that she's interested in your best friend. What do you do? I don't like this one already. Um, sorry, my room is quite hot. Uh, set them up at a restaurant and put in drink. So he's, he's embarrassed himself. That's so me. 
<laughs> uh, tell your friend what she thinks and try to convince them that she's unattractive. Don't tell your friend and go for her yourself. Be a good sport and tell your friend. I'm a kind guy, so I'm going to go for why. Why? Because I'm not. Keep it to yourself. This is doggy dog world. No, it isn't. But that's just selfish. You should think of your friends first. Well, I do anyway, so it's fucking pointless. And you're not going to get any less by hanging, handing over every pretty broad you see to your best friend. Let's worry about him. Let him worry about himself. No, no. He's your best friend for a reason. You should help him out where you can. That's my opinion. I don't like this game already. It's been cheap. Okay. A girl you like comes up to you and says she isn't interested in being with you. What do you do? Ask her why she thinks that way and try to convince her. Otherwise, psh, flash her with your drink, cut your losses and move on. Um, act sad. Fuck that. I cut your losses, mate. I'll, I'll just give up. I'm like, yeah, mate, I'm done. You should just cut your losses and move on. There's nothing worse than acting depressed. And desperate, you can always find someone better. True fact, that one is actually true. Three out of six. Damn. But I think that most of that was cheap. Is it fair enough? If you want to go for it, then yeah, you might be really sly. But I would, I would find that really too sly. That that that's not something I would want my friends to do to me. So I prefer my friends to be honest and help me out when I want help or need help. And I hope you guys think the same. Hit that like button if you liked this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. This is me trying to help you guys out, uh, I guess. <laughs> For those who aren't good with talking to girls or relationships, I can't know. I'm good with organizing people. I can put people with people. Myself, I'm screwed up. I help others more than I help myself, as shown by the quiz. But I'm shit. <laughs> but three out of six ain't bad. Too well of free ain't bad. Okay, that's the last time I'm going to do that. Uh, I'll see you guys next time. And I hope you enjoyed. And leave a like if you did. Subscribe if you're not already subscribed. If you are subscribed, show this to a friend so they subscribe and like me and shoot. And yes, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time. As always, Rishimoto, signing off. Bye-bye.